here? Oh, you're resetting. review i loved it i loved it it was great although you've I... been to cracker barrel a lot yeah but you've been to a different one was this one as good as the one you've been to before yes especially the pancakes that had they were delicious i liked the hash brown casserole but i feel like it it with the bacon and with the eggs and with the onions and everything it felt a little too over salted well, I mean, that's kind of the thing is that they do a lot of salted food. So, uh, each of the girls had an orange juice and yeah, I've got it off camera. Okay. Um, I got coffee instead of orange juice. Everybody had water. I did not know this, Rebecca. It said fruity pancakes, but then they still charged an extra dollar twenty nine for your strawberries. Did y'all bring your salt, your, uh, syrup bottles? Um, my I didn't bowl. get one. You didn't get one. Mine was a legit bowl. Okay. That's weird. Um, so you had the cheesecake pancakes. Were they good? Oh, and she also bought sunglasses in there. Yes, they were very delicious. I love Excuse the me. <laughs> oh, whatever. Um, who had the, it says BYO homestyle breakfast, or build your own. That was me. I did a build your own breakfast because I wanted grits because we didn't get to do grits when we were in South Carolina because budget and we, the trip, the trip back was from South Carolina was supposed to be three hours. It was five because we got stuck in traffic for two hours on the way back on the interstate. Um, so like we wanted to get back and we were not able to eat like, we wanted to eat like shrimp and grits while we were there, but we weren't able to. So I was like, you know what? I really want grits. So I got grits and I did like a build your own breakfast. I really like the build your own breakfast because then you can just kind of piece together what you want and then add the cost up as you go. Um, did you like the hash browns though? Was it different than just like ordering a side of hash browns with something else? Um, it was different. Yeah. Would you rather do like adding hash browns to something else in the future or would you order that? Um, I'd probably add hash browns on the side because while well, I said it was really good, but it was also really salted. But them. we don't normally do like a lot of high salt breakfast though. Like even when we make eggs at home, we don't salt them as much or anything like that. And we don't eat like a ton of like bacon, ham. It's usually like a specialty thing for us. Um... Grandpa's breakfast, you order chicken instead of a different meat. How was the chicken at breakfast? It was good. It was boneless. Yeah, it was boneless, so that was a nice plus. I was expecting it to have big old chunky bones inside, and it was big old chunky meat. So, was your, Madeline, lean back because I can't see Rebecca, was your breakfast still good, the pancakes, even though we didn't get syrup and we didn't know about it until just now? It was still good? So, how would you rate this Cracker Barrel, like, on a scale of one to five? Four and a half. Four and a half, because they forgot your syrup. And the pancakes were slightly burned. Ooh, yeah, it was... They were busy. They were really busy, though. They were yeah. so busy. And right now, Van's going to make a lot of noise as I turn it on. It is 12.11, so we actually got, like, brunch time. Like, they were already serving lunch. Um, but yeah, I would definitely come to this one again. I love that it's convenient. It's really close to a Sam's Club. It's right off of the interstate. Um, it's a really great convenient place. I really like it. I would probably eat this one again. Matt's not a big fan of Cracker Barrel because in his opinion, like he would rather go out to eat something that he can't make at home. So that's why he's not a huge fan of Cracker Barrel. So whenever he was unable to come with us on this trip, um, we were like, hey, why don't we do Cracker Barrel instead of Shoney's? Cause like he will do Shoney's for breakfast, but like, for Cracker Barrel style though, where you have to wait and be served and all, he would prefer Shoney's instead where it's a buffet and you can kind of build your own breakfast. And I think that's the other difference for them as well is she's eaten uh, Cracker Barrel a lot. She used to live really close to one, but the other girls are used to like Shoney's and usually with Shoney's, we have like yogurt or fresh fruit that we have with our food and that kind of balances the salt as well. And I need more windshield washer cleaner. Um, <laughs> But I think that's another thing why it was different for her. Wait, staff was awesome. 
the weight stuff was amazing um most of them were four like all the ones that had stars they were mostly four stars that so was pretty cool and their boss was super nice and you could tell he was being super nice to his employees and i love i love supporting any place where like you can see a manager actually jumping in and helping his employees and encouraging them and i love going to any place that does that and the manager that was on staff today it's a saturday morning afternoon I will always want to encourage place like that. But now we are going to head out and head over to Zoo Knoxville.